All right, kiddo, let's see if we can do this. I'm going to go to Screencast-O-Matic and see what I can do here. Um, again, hopefully this will work because I do have a Mac just like you. First thing, download and install. And then download now. And then download now, okay? Uh, once this finishes downloading, left, same as when we're at school. It is uh, something that we're going to open up. It's a little different. We have to actually drag over the Screencast-O-Matic to our App Store. So we're going to take a look at that. It's going to take a little longer. I'm not entirely sure why, but it seems to have more megabytes than the one at school when it's an Apple download. So, okay, now we can click on it. And there it is, it's opening. And we have to drag Screencast-O-Matic to Applications folder. So take it and drag it in. All right, give it a moment and it's copying into the applications. And hopefully that has done what it needs to do. Not entirely sure what just happened here. But let's go. I'm going to go down into Launchpad. I'm going to click back in and okay, take a look. So now Screencast-O-Matic is in. If you go into Launchpad, click on the little Launchpad thing down here, Screencast-O-Matic is there. And then we can open it up. Okay? So yeah, it's a little bit different. It's verifying. Um, just click open. And let's see what happens. OK. Uh, enable Pro Features. This way it's going to open up Screencast-O-Matic for us. And then log in. All right. Once we're able to log in, remember it's P S C H O E N at E R S D dot O R G and the password E R O C K four four three. I'm gonna log in. And okay, now it's going to work. So again, get the new update because it seems to like to get the new update. Don't understand why every single time, but okay. Click done. And now I wonder if we press start recording on this. Uh, okay, it's going to give us a problem. So again, go back into Launchpad, click Screencast O Matic, and see if it starts to do what it needs to do. Maybe. All right, it's loading. Let's see what happens here. It's doing this missing plugin or an inactive plugin because of um, the fact that we don't do Flash on Apple's. But let's see if this will actually work. Sorry that mine's so slow. And then good, great. So there you go. Once you open it up again from your launch pad, it should just be opening up and then you can record. Let me know how this works. I hope it does and if not get back to me and I will uh, try and help you through it. Okay?